Okay, this is update four. Show you what's going on here. See if I can find some focus. There's the strawberry plant that I put in the net cup. It's actually doing really good. It's got some awesome new roots out of there and some new growth. It's coming in is great. Uh, some of the old leaves look a little haggard, but the new growth that's coming is perfect. So I think it's doing pretty good. There's the tomato plants. Might look a little yellow, but I think they're gonna start looking good pretty soon once those roots really pick up. I think this one's got a little mosaic virus or something, but I'm gonna keep it alive just because I only have three of them and don't really want to kill it. I think this small Roma tomato might have it too, but I'm not gonna toss it either. We'll see what happens. Those are the basil. We got cilantro and parsley. Uh, my first little serrano chili starting to pop through right here. So those are starting to fruit. All the jalapenos are going nuts. There's tons of them on there. So jalapenos are actually doing really good. They love it. Uh, the little strawberry plant bulbs that I had in here, they've actually got some green growth going out of them. So they did live. I think this one's got a tiny bit in there too. I don't know if you can see it in the bottom, but that's got some green growth. I threw a few extra plants in here because I wasn't really sure if I needed them or not. I thought I had too many fish for my my system, so I threw some extra plants in there. Uh, those are my artichoke plants. They're in soil. I'm going to throw them in the front garden as soon as they get big enough. You can see the strawberry plants are actually doing okay. It's got a nice little flower on it now, so I might get one little fruit. Pretty funny. That one lived. You can see the new growth off the one in the back that broke, so it survived too. That's the mint plant I pulled out of my neighbor's yard, just shoved in there. <laughs> Seems to like it. Uh, that's the lettuce in the back. It's just as old as the other one, but not doing as good, so obviously it likes the NFT better than this flood and drain. And all the kale popped up, so I'm going to have to thin those out soon. Not sure what I'm going to do with all of them, but that's the kale. Uh, the worms are still in there doing fine. They're still alive. The uh, blueberry plants, I think I really tortured that one on the right when I took all the soil off of it. Gave it some root shock. I gave it some B1 today, see if it does a little better, but it's not looking so good when the, the left is doing okay. So blueberry trees seem to be okay. There's the little fish. They're probably hungry. They want some food. We can wait a few more minutes. But uh, that's pretty much everything. That's the avocado tree. I did top it a while back. Took a long time for it to recover and get the two little tops on there. So I don't know if it's the best thing to top avocado trees. I threw in a few extra kale seeds in there too. They all sprouted. Might thin those out. Maybe leave one or two. We'll see what happens. But it seems like all the plants are digging the uh, aquaponic system so far, except the one blueberry tree. Uh, here's my little hand meter Right now it's 7.1 parts per million only at 620. They don't really go above 640 after taking water out and adding clean water. But I'll test my other levels later today and let you guys know how they're doing. But that's it. Update number four. Aquaponics rocks. Seems to be doing okay. Thanks for watching.